I'm going to make some apples. Finding childcare isn't easy. It was a challenge for Serenity Archambault to get a spot for her three-year-old daughter. Um, it was pretty hard. We just threw her on wait lists around the city, hoping one of them would call us back, and uh, they did. With students going back to class next week, some parents are still scrambling to find before and after school care for older children. Here on Child Care Director, Charanjeet Singh says around 200 people are on the wait list, in line for 15 licensed spaces for kids between 7 and 12 years old, which are currently full. They are looking for a space. They need to go to work, but uh, where do they find the space? There's been a surge in demand since $10 a day daycare was introduced in April. The Manitoba government committed to using federal funding to create 23,000 new childcare spaces by 2026, but most of those spaces are for kids under seven. Manitoba Child Care Association Executive Director Jody Kale says more focus is needed on expanding school age care. It would take the investments and political will of a provincial government to also then expand childcare spaces for the seven to 12 year old children. With a provincial election right around the corner, political parties are releasing their plans for childcare. Outside this Furmore Avenue daycare run by the YMCA, liberal leader Dougal Lamont promised to increase wages and benefits for early childhood educators and make it easier for organizations to access infrastructure funding. The 7 to 12, we can also, there are, we could be expanding, um, we'll look at expanding school programs. The NDP says it would expand $10 a day child care for older kids to summer and holidays and make hours more flexible for shift workers. The Progressive Conservatives say they've used provincial funding to open 3,200 spaces for 7 to 12 year olds with 1,000 more on the way. While her daughter has a spot for now, Archambault is concerned about finding one when she gets older. School is like more strict start times, whereas daycare here, you can drop them off kind of at any point. She hopes more spaces will be created before her daughter starts school. Josh Crabb, CBC News, Winnipeg.